Hi everyone, welcome back. I hope you all are doing great. I'm doing okay. We're going to be doing some off-season crafts. Today, well, I'm going to do a project share with you, but I'm going to show you what I use to make this project. I use this pumpkin spice paper pad from Michaels that I got. It says 2018, so I think I got it in 2018, not last year. Um, do a quick flip through for you. Now, when I first saw this paper pad, I'm sure you were like, the blue spoke to you. Yes, the blue grayish colors definitely called my name. and was like, Brandy, we need to go home with you and be a part of your crafty space for a while before you cut us up. And I obliged them. I also used um, this Jean Hatfield uh some of the stickers out of this Jean Hatfield sticker book. You know, this is probably one of the most genius ideas they could have ever done for someone like myself. Even though I know it's plant it's for planners. The one thing I would say that twenty dollars for nine hundred and seventy four stickers is a bit much. A bit much. Um uh, because that's how much it costs at like um Hobby Lobby and other places that sell them. Even for six ninety nine because you know now um the last time I in March or February when I went to Tuesday morning, they had them um, for 5 or either four ninety nine. So, you know, keep your eye out. Sometimes they'll get stuff higher price and then sometimes it's lower price and sometimes it's lower and higher. And you just got to look through it to see which one is the cheapest. So, um, or if you don't mind spending six ninety nine, which I obviously didn't mind. I was like, I got to have it. And I like these because it's like really fally in my opinion. It's like fall colors and i like that and then i use some um sheets from other paper pads i'll show you if i can remember where they came from inside of here i know i use a martha stewart paper pad and a die cuts with a view paper pad yeah and um one paper studio so this is called oh so thankful i use this little um wood sticker that i uh inked up with squeezed orange and put it on there and it definitely says thanksgiving right so what i was thinking i would be doing is making a few of these like six or seven and putting pictures in them i really like this one so it has all this gold falling and then it says we are family so i was thinking that i can get a good a decent picture of myself the big roommate little roommate put it in here and where it says happy family maybe the same thing or a little a note of what was going on or write you know a note here picture here because it says happy family and has a little heart right there now this is says i love this page this is a paper studio paper it comes so hobby lobby has a paper pack assortment for 5.99 and it's a paper studio so i always get it when it's on a paper studios on half off and i got uh two of those because i was like this is really good for the seasonal crafts that i do and um i like it it says turkey cranberries yummy pumpkin apple pie pumpkin pie um it's really cool and this one says gather and i always thought that this was really really nice to do you know if we do thanksgiving which we don't do like a traditional thanksgiving because it's just, uh the big roommate doesn't eat a lot of the things that traditional southern um, people eat he's weird on holidays and i'm weird on holidays i wish we could have like a seafood crab shrimp boil but he doesn't like crabs so uh, I usually just make a small, it depends, I usually make a small hen or um, a large hen or a chicken, a whole chicken, bake it, or a turkey and, um, you know, some of the fixings because he doesn't like um, dressing, which I love dressing. He calls it stuffing, so you can tell right now that we're from different worlds when it comes to food. So some things he don't like and some things I don't like. So anyway. I put a heart inside of a heart. I just thought that would be really cool to do. And then over here it says gather now. I can't remember where these stickers come from. I know I got them in a D stash. And it says American Greeting. Um, and it looks like this. I don't know what the actual name was. Because whoever I bought it from, they cut all their labeling off to make more space. And right here it says gather here. And this is a sticker, a stamp set from Joy and Fabric. In case you I don't think their little skews work but in case it does and this is a Miss Sparkling Co when it was a dollar ninety nine uh I 
I don't believe that they have a dollar ninety nine anymore. At least not during Christmas time. It was two forty nine. And these are some of Maggie Home stickers and it just says happy little moments. And this says together. And I thought this would be really cool. This is a Maggie Holmes and this is from Jean Jen Hatfield. I thought it'd be cute, like little arrow wood or stick arrows and trees. And on the back it just says remember this. And I'll probably put like, you know, whatever year it is. But I think that this is going to be my thing for now, at least for a few months. And then, you know, I told you, you can just sit it on your mantle, fireplace, table, coffee table. You know, I think some people have like statement pieces. This would be cool. Be like, oh, what is this? And you can, you know, look at it or whatever. So anyway, so thank you all for watching. Until next time, happy crafting.